Yeah, well, good. Would you like to introduce everyone that's here? Do you have some? Did you have some other folks with you, or? Yes, <laughs> they snuck in. Uh, Troy, do you want to start? Uh, sure. So, uh, I'm Troy Williams with Lebanon County Christian Ministries. Also here with the Lebanon County Coalition. Ben Good morning, I'm Crystal Blake. I am um, the Director of Community Wellness, Behavioral Health and Social Services for Welsh Mountain Health Centers. I'm, I'm Jocelyn Stakeham. I'm with MHIDEI, and I'm the current treasurer for the uh, Homeless Coalition. I'm Janine Mouser. I'm the CAS coordinator for the county and also here for the Homeless Coalition. I think that's all of us. Well, thanks for checking. Um, and for folks who don't know me, my name is Mike Ritter, and I'm the chair of the Lebanon County Coalition to End Homelessness. So thank you uh, so much for allowing us to address the board this morning. Um, sponsored by the National Coalition for the Homeless, National Hunger and Homelessness Awareness Week has been held each year since 1975, the week before Thanksgiving. Believe it or not, it's already November. This is a time when Americans begin thinking about the areas of their lives for which they are thankful. It is a perfect time for us to share our compassion with our fellow neighbors who struggle to maintain stability and for us to contribute to a social movement dedicated to a world where no one has to experience hunger, poverty, or homelessness. In particular, the 15% of our county's children identified by the Robert Wood Johnson Foundation who currently live in poverty. 15% may not seem like a large figure, but it translates into nearly 4,800 children right here in Lebanon County. Additionally, 48% of our county's children are eligible for free or reduced lunches at school. As for homelessness in particular, the Education for Children and Youth Experiencing Homelessness program, in partnership with our six school districts, identified 351 students accessing homeless services during the 16-17 school year, an increase of about 70% over the previous year. Furthermore, a local review found that 733 individuals, including children, in 2017 alone accessed at least one of our various shelter programs. The Robert Wood Johnson Foundation has also determined that 10% of our overall population here in Lebanon County is food insecure, while 13% of households struggle with severe housing problems, defined as experiencing at least one of four problems, including overcrowding, high housing costs, or lack of either kitchen or plumbing facilities. The purpose of the Lebanon County Coalition to End Homelessness is to provide leadership in the prevention and eradication of homelessness in Lebanon County. Hunger and Homelessness Awareness Week is one avenue we use to educate the public, draw attention to the problem of poverty, and build up the base of support in the community. We are very, very proud this year to be kicking off Hunger and Homelessness Awareness Week with a special presentation by author and aspiring theologian Mike Yankoski. Mr. Yankoski is the author of four books, including Under the Overpass, A Journey of Faith on the Streets of America, which highlights his experience with homelessness. For five months in six different American cities, Michael and his friend Sam intentionally, intentionally ate from trash cans and at homeless shelters, slept under bridges, and panhandled in order to survive. They chose to do this not only to better understand the plight of the American homeless, but also to observe how people interacted with those who were experiencing homelessness. His book captures this journey on the streets and relates the people, experiences, and revelations that have forever changed his life. He will speak and sign books at Salem Lutheran Church in Lebanon from 3 o'clock to 5 o'clock on Saturday, November 10th. This event is free and open to everyone, and hopefully there are flyers making their way around the room for that event as well as the others that we have. We then invite the public to join us at Texas Roadhouse in Palmyra on November 14th, 3 to 10 p.m. for a special dine and donate fundraiser. You may access a voucher for this event on the Community Health Council website or on our Facebook page. And while you wait for your table, you may, for a $5 donation, participate in our balloon pop and win a prize. Every balloon, as always, is a winner and this year's grand prize is a recliner 
in your choice of nine colors, graciously donated by Bob Hawks for Home Furnishings. And all proceeds of this fundraiser benefit the Coalition's Youth Fund. Then on November 16th, we urge residents to wear a red shirt for Red Shirt Day which encourages schools and communities to support assistance programs for children experiencing homelessness and brings awareness to this issue. Finally, folks are invited to attend open houses at, at Fresh Start, and if you have questions about that, Troy's here in the room to answer those. Um, that's on November 13th, and 11 and Rescue Mission in Agape on November 15th, and times for each of those are 11.30 to 1.30. For more information, Folks may visit the Community Health Council website or again find us on Facebook. We thank you again for your time here today and your ongoing dedication to ending homelessness for our friends and neighbors in Lebanon County. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Any of the other folks with you uh, want to say anything or is that, does that take care of it? That takes care of it. Okay. <laughs> That's my job. <laughs> Um, Mike, I was curious, the 70% increase, was that perhaps due to the flooding in Puerto Rico, those places that people moved in? Is that a temporary uh, increase? Uh, I don't know that we'll be able to determine if it's temporary until we get another year or two out. But it, I think it's, uh, we can't say that for sure, but it's, a, it's, it's certainly a theory that is mm -hmm. logical. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. We have a proclamation. Okay. <clears throat> Whereas, for over 25 years, the National Coalition for the Homeless and National Student Campaign Against Hunger and Homelessness have sponsored National Hunger and Homelessness, Homelessness Awareness Week. And whereas the purpose of the proclamation is to educate the public about the many reasons people are hungry and homeless, including, but not limited to, the shortage of affordable housing in Lebanon County for residents with low income, and to encourage support for homeless assistance service providers as well as community service opportunities for students and school service organizations. And whereas there are numerous local organizations within Lebanon County who are committed to sheltering and providing supportive services as well as meals and food supplies to the homeless. And whereas the Lebanon County Commissioners recognize that hunger and homelessness continues to be a serious problem for many individuals and families in Lebanon County. And whereas the intent of National Hunger and Homelessness Awareness Week is consistent with the activities of the Lebanon County Co Coalition to End Homelessness. Now therefore we, the Commissioners of Lebanon County, do hereby proclaim November 10 through the 18th, 2018 as National Hunger and Homelessness Awareness Week in Lebanon County. Further, we encourage all citizens to recognize that many people do not have housing and need support from citizens, as well as private, public, and non-profit service entities. Okay.